Welcome to RaiGurkul.com. In this video, we will discuss about how to create automated subtasks using Jira automation rule. When we are working with any projects which is required multiple tasks to be created whenever any user stories are added, then that time we will need to add subtasks automatically. So it's it's not at all possible to add multiple tasks within the one user story because when we are working for any specific project which is having lot many things to be created so this time the automation rule will help us the team to add subtasks automatically so we'll show you how we can do it through automatically within atlassian jira cloud instance so let's say we are creating any defects or any user story so within that user story we want to divide this user story into three parts one part is for the subtask for development team second part or second subtask will be for the qa team and third subtask will be for uat team so let me show you here so this is a user story for development so maybe we can payment. So let me add this user story. And here, when we'll view this user story, we can see we can create subtasks. So let's say I want to create subtasks for three different teams so that whenever each team will work, they will use their own subtasks. So here I will add just subtask for dev, subtask for QA and subtask for uat so generally if we have this type of requirements where manually user has to go inside every user story and create this type of activity so probably we can use jira automation so rule so when we are using jira automation rule and whenever we will create a new user story automatically these subtasks will be created for us so we'll see here how we can work or how we can do it using jira automation rule so i will just navigate it to automation or global automation rule and from here we can create the rule so whenever new user story will be added we can have subtask created automatically or auto created subtask now if you if you're visiting this channel for the first time and you want to learn about jira please watch my jira playlist I've also created Jira API playlist as well as this is the third playlist for the Jira automations. So if you want to learn the complete Jira automations, please watch my Jira automation playlist. I will include all three playlist link in the description tab. So that will be easy for you to refer. Now, this is a create tab where we are creating, but for creation of the rule here, we have create rule. Inside the create rule, we, we will first select as all components as created issue create so whenever any new issues will be created we will have this type of conditions so within that we can add this condition so in the condition field maybe we will add if issue field conditions so in issue field condition we have to just select issue type reason behind it issue type here whenever we are creating any issues so this is an issue type so if we are creating it for the story then probably we have to select the issue type here so as of now i am just uh, fixing as a story but we can say select any fields whichever is required for our automation need now i will click on save after that i want a new actions so in this i want create multiple subtasks so just right here create subtask and you can see this is automatically available so as of now i want to add just development subtask next subtask i want to create it for qa subtask and finally, the third one is UAT subtask. Now, all this are done. If 
I want to remove any of the fields simply I will click on remove and this particular fields will be removed from here but what if I want to add additional fields so additional fields maybe I can add the descriptions exactly same like a uh, summary apart of that we we have the structure and if I want to add any specific fields or environment so probably I will include the environment here as a development and then here I will show dev environment and in in the parent issue types I'm just selecting current issues so whichever is the current issue will become a parent for this type of fields I will just click on save and then next is next I want to add the fields as QA and here exactly same way I will select it here description QA subtask next current issues and apart of that i will also select the environment so in environment field i will give here qa click on save and the final fields i am having here is uat so in add field sections again i will add summary exactly same like descriptions and additional fields i will select here uat so this is done and after that i, I want to see if this is to create subtask auto automatically now turn it on and this rule is set to use now once this will be created we we can see the response so let me create it and show you how we can use this automation so let's see this is user user story created by automation rule now i don't want to do anything here just click on create and then once i'll navigate it to the ap one to one we will have three different sections to be created because we have created ap or oh, let me refresh this page where is our sub task oh i think we have missed something okay the reason behind of uh, failing this we we are getting the environment so environment is not configured for this project that's the reason we we are unable to get the desired output so let me remove this field and then we'll try it here okay. i think again we have made some mistake so here i'm selecting this and then we are done again i will select the same same project save it and now here as well i am assigning the same project make it public and this time this rule will work perfectly fine so let's see i want automation rule for user story so here i will just simply click on create and navigate it to the ap 124 and we will have this subtask created successfully now you can see all the subtask is added automatically so here if you go to the history sections you will find it out in the history or work log we will have this options updated so who who did this options or who made it available or who has created we can see in the work log sections generally if we want to create a subtask for all the user story we can add the automation rule that will be easy for others to be tracked so that's all about how to create subtask automatically within a user story hope you enjoyed the content if you think so this will be useful don't forget to share with the new circle thank you for watching